All right, guys, some of y'all been wondering how long it takes to get to the end of the Port Aransas jetty. Well, I'm at the end right now. I'm gonna do it in reverse. I'm gonna start walking. All right, guys, time to make the walk. Take the trash that we picked up. A couple of bottles, plastic bottles, glass bottles. All right, let's see. Right now, what time? Watch says it's 157, 158. Good luck, guys. Thanks. Uh -huh. Appreciate it. I'll fix my hat. I'm thinking walking at a eh, steady pace should take about 15 minutes. The walk is about seven tenths of a mile. <sighs> Roughly half the walk is on concrete like this but then there's broken sections where you got to walk on the jetty rocks all these granite blocks are brand new they've put them up a couple of months ago which is good because they're meant to protect the channel from filling in but what it also does is whenever there's waves it breaks the waves and it keeps the sidewalk from getting wet and in turn being covered in algae <sighs> so it's not slippery like it usually is this time of year right Ruben yep. yeah I had to pick it up yeah all right I'm thinking about 15 minutes. Man, y'all should have uh, seen me this morning, guys. I was running over here. I was running a little late. So I was running. I got I got from the beginning to the end in eight minutes. I don't recommend that, though. Dolphin. I don't know if they plan on getting it or what. Whenever it's usually covered in algae. In previous years, sometimes it's so bad you can't even walk on it, so you're forced to walk on these rocks right here to the left. But now, it doesn't seem to be a problem. So you can get here a little safer and quicker. Because a lot of these rocks are slanted, and of course, they'd be wet as well. As you can see the sidewalk ends, now you got to walk on these granite blocks, so where you got to be careful as well. A lot of them are slanted, sometimes they're wet and slippery. Sometimes there's big gaps like this, so you definitely gotta watch your step. Right there, that, that's a big one too. Another big one, another big one.
That was a big drop off right here. Another big one. And then back to the sidewalk. As you can tell, I'm mean, at sidewalks. 80 years old so this piece was broken off it was falling into the water but they put these new granite blocks to hold it in and of course protect the channel and same over here before it used to get wet get covered in algae like that green algae right there sometimes you couldn't walk on it or you'd have to walk right here on the edge where I'm at right now or even sometimes you had to walk on these rocks and as you can see these the rocks are not flat so it was sketchy either way you put it in the dark. yeah in the dark you know five o'clock in the morning <laughs> all right <sighs> nice flat rocks right there a little bit more fishing room too. A lot of people like to fish over here. You can set your stuff on the rocks and not have to worry about, you know, other people coming by, stepping on your gear. Chop. Watch your step, book it right there. This uh, buoy right here, that's about halfway, roughly. There's another broken section where the sidewalk ends again. You gotta walk on the granite blocks. You gotta watch your step over here, guys. These ones right here are brand new, but last year, a lot flatter. Compared to these ones, these ones are a little crooked over time. Slanted, bigger gaps, drops off. There's a big block right here. You can sit on that one. Use it as a chair or a bench. There's a section of sidewalk right here. And, but then it quickly is broken again. You gotta walk on these rocks. These are brand new rocks as well. The old rocks you had to walk on were right here, to my left. Some gaps here.
back in the day, 20 plus years ago, they actually had some black asphalt covering a lot of these rocks. So you can see from right here, left and right in front of me. Uh, so it was a little flatter, so you could just walk on top of it, but of course, it's broken off over the years. Now here's a brand new concrete sidewalk that they did uh, back in, last, think, year, last year, I think they started in April, 2021. Mind you, there was already a sidewalk here. It was just a little cracked. Yeah, kind of knows. Uh, there was already a sidewalk here, it was just cracked. But you could still walk on it just fine, bring a jetty cart over here just fine. Bring a jetty cart. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You might need a new suspension if you brought your jetty cart over here. Though. I mean, hey, it's not worse than the streets in Corpus though. Let's be real about that. But even then, you know, this sidewalk right here we're walking on, barely, not even a year old yet. And there's already cracks in it. And uh, I guess it was a little too much work for them to actually pave over here on top of these rocks. So, you know, they filled it in with the small rocks, yeah, and sand so the tractor could get through to pour the concrete. Would have been too much work, you know, for them to actually do it right, but whatever. Uh, and now the other section of brand new concrete, literally almost at the beach. Water is beautiful here in the surf and of course in the channel. And just like that, guys, you're already at the beach. Let me see what time it is. Right now it's uh, 2.11. Ruben, how long does it say on the GoPro? 15 minutes. There you go, that's what I said, 15 minutes. A nice uh, leisurely walk to get to the end of the jetties. Port Ranch jetties, guys. Not too bad. All right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you like it, be sure to hit that like button. And if you want to see more videos like this, maybe Packery Channel, Fish Pass, make sure to hit subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys.